Rodgers has his chance to try and answer Matt Ryan. The numbers are insane for Aaron Rodgers this postseason. Just willed his team with a huge... Come on, Rodgers. Crosby to a win last week over Dallas. Nelson at the top of the screen. Yay, Nelson's playing. Montgomery in the backfield, and he gets it. Cuts back, now takes it upfield. And on the first play from scrimmage, a four-yard gain for Ty Montgomery. Before this drive started, a little moment between Aaron Rodgers and Bill Vinovich, all the pressure in the world on those two guys with their respective jobs and able to share a lot. Right, come on. He's playing with a lot of confidence, as we know, but to come in now and... This game started the way that we anticipated. Atlanta gets the opening kickoff. They take it 80 yards for a touchdown, and now we'll see if Aaron Rodgers and company can match. Second and six. Time for Rodgers. There's yes! Yay, yeah, Jordy Nelson caught it! Yes! Good job, no good job, Jordy Nelson. Packers were expecting to start this game with man coverage from the Falcons, and that's what they draw here. I'm so surprised. I'm so surprised that um, Jordy Nelson is better. And then he takes the hit, well, he, well, he broke his ribs. We'll see how he holds up when he takes a fall right on those ribs, the left side there. But I'm impressed that he's even in this game playing just a few weeks removed. Me too, dude. I, I am also surprised too. To start today for Jordy Nelson. Now in the slot on the near side, first down. Rodgers. Yes, Jordy Nelson. Yes, I love you, Jordy Nelson. I love you, Jordy Nelson, so much. Do you think the Atlanta Falcons really believed that it was even a chance that Jordy Nelson was going to play in this game? Well, I don't, I don't know what they thought, but I didn't think he would. I, I really didn't. I thought that they would say, well, you know, yeah, this is a really important game, but last week's game was important, and. You try to get him as healthy as you can, but anyone who's had broken ribs, I have not. But anyone who's had them would tell you it's the most painful injury they've ever had. So for him to be out here going through and doing what he's done already on this possession is, is awfully impressive. On first down, pass is caught. And in the middle of the field is Devontae Adams, who's dealing with his own injury. A twisted ankle from last week, but here's that hit by Leon Hall on Jordy Nelson. He stayed down on all fours on the bench area for quite a while. He said it's the most pain he's ever been in in his life, and during the week, he had a tough time just drawing breath. And here he is a couple of weeks later taking hits in an NFL game with a trip to the Super Bowl on the line. Second and four. Pass is oh, so close. And Aaron Rodgers took a hit when he let this one fly. It's third and four. Well, the Falcons have been able to get a little pressure here in this opening possession on Rodgers. He hasn't been as oh, close. Oh, that was close. Courtney Upshaw is the one who's able to get home at the end of that, and he's got a big role in this game. They lose Adrian Claiborne. Their second leading sacker last week. That was close. He's going to have to help pick up the slack. All right, come on. Let, let's let get a first down or a, or a touchdown. What? Third down, so critical in this game. You cannot miss opportunity, and this will be a big one. On the other side of this break. Well, we flash back to week eight. And this game, the Packers and Falcons here in Atlanta. Aaron Rodgers throws a touchdown pass to Jeff Janis. The Packers lead by six with 358 left. And Matt Ryan answered to Mohamed Sanu. 31 ticks left. And the Falcons won the game 33-32. And the two quarterbacks combined for ridiculous number seven touchdowns no interceptions and a combined quarterback rating of 128.5 yeah we were here for that one and it was a lot of fun to cover and both of these offense of course the Packers they got on their roll then just a few weeks later and have been lighting it up with a lot of points on the scoreboard averaging over 30 points a game during that stretch and then of course the high scoring offense in all of football with the Falcons 
Third down and four. Roger no! Gets rid of it, avoids Are you sack. serious? But it's fourth down. Deion Jones, a rookie middle linebacker. Come on, Rogers. You are so close, Rogers. Number 45, it's just a five-man rush. And he comes up the middle, they turn him loose. Somebody is supposed to pick him up. Rogers was expecting it. Forces him to get the ball out of his hands and a big stop for this Falcons defense. And now Mason Crosby, who has hit on 23 straight during the postseason from 41. What? Missed it wide right. How did you miss it? The snap.